Tom Brunt from Tebweb Innovations, Doylestown, PA, north of Philadelphia. I'm here with uh, one of my printers that I have here is a uh, Creality Ender 3. Uh, these are extremely popular printers. Um, a lot of you out there, if you're searching for this video, you probably own one. So um, I've always shied away from doing multicolor prints because with a single extruder, it's very difficult. Um, or so I thought it was difficult. A previous printer I had uh, it was always a hit or miss result, but I have found that like the Ender 3 does this so easily that you will find many uses to uh, start printing uh, multicolors. Uh, this here is my company logo. Three colors, white, light blue, and yellow. All done with a single extruder. Uh, this was really surprisingly easy to do. Uh, and uh, I'm going to take you uh, step by step and how I did it with the Ender 3. First of all, when you're designing the object to print, you have to make sure that each layer that you want a different color is higher than the layers beneath it. It doesn't have to be much. Four or five layers will work just fine. Now you uh, import it into your slicer. In my case, it's Simplify 3D. I like that one, but most of them will work the same way. Now what you want to do is scroll through layer by layer until you get to the one where just the layer you want with a different color starts to print. For this object, it's layers 11 for the second color and 24 for the third color. Next, you want to go back to your settings. For Simplify 3D, you want to select Scripts. And now what you want to do is add this text to the Post Processing section. Now you notice I have uh, two lines there. Replace Layer 11 M600. M600 is the Change Filament Code. You can add as many of these replace lines for however many color changes you'd like to make. Now you're ready to print the first color layer. comes the first layer change at layer 11, right on schedule. At the final color change, we'll watch the printer step by step. Now to resume our print, this time with the blue color. Time for the final color change where we'll watch everything step by step. Speed this up a little bit as it extrudes a fair amount of filament to make sure the extruder is clean. Now back to the final color print, yellow.
So there you have it. Uh, there's how you do multiple color printing with the Ender 3 and a single extruder. Um, you can only go by layers, obviously, but that still gives you a lot of versatility, especially for things like signs, logos, and things of that nature. So um, I'm sure you'll find a lot of stuff now to happily multicolor 3D print with. So happy printing, folks.